What in the world? Oh, oh my goodness! Oh no! <laughs> What is up, Yorobun? So, today we are finishing Dota Dragon's Blood. I know that usually I've been doing one episode per week, but since I've been hearing about episode 7 and 8, I decided I'm gonna just pair them up both together, and we're just gonna watch 7 and 8, we're gonna finish it off, and we're gonna see the ending of season 1. In the previous episode, from what I remember, we left out with Invoker talking to Terribly, and he seemed to be making a deal, so we'll see what happens from that deal if you guys haven't already hit the like subscribe ring that bell for notification guys become a patreon supporter of agashian and i join our community and let's get right into this Ooh, i think that's boss no wex oh he's he's doing his tornado move Ooh, who's he calling don't tell me he's bringing dragons he caught a dragon with that power what oh man what are you doing? Ooh, there's another one. I am Lyrak, the mouse, mother of oceans, mother of storms. Invoker's fighting one of the dragons one on one. That's insane. I will not be contained. Ooh. All right, if Invoker can one on one her, that man is that man is legit. Oh, he's digging in deep. Ooh. He did it. Oh my god. He did it. He caught one of the freaking drags. What in the world? What is Invoker doing? Oh, he's oh my god, he's old. Oh lord, he used all his powers and he like got old. Shit. That's <laughs> that's crazy. Dude. Hey, that's his daughter. So he just summoned that thing out of Nowhere. In World of Warcraft, I believe, when you play the expansion pack for World of Warcraft and you play as a Blood Elf, I think, you actually start off in a place and the, the tower that like Invoker is in actually looks like this, which is kind of funny that they still kept that lore because they didn't have to. They could have like changed it all up. But I like the fact that Dota, they're keeping it kind of to the lore of, you know, how it came from. You know, because Dota 1 was the the characters were based off of Warcraft 3's characters. And so you can see a lot of war a lot of Warcraft inspiration in the artwork and stuff. I like that. I like that they're they're keeping that inspiration. Of course, it's not the original inspiration. Of course, yes, I understand that elves, the idea of elves and blood elves and drows and all that stuff, that they came from totally different stuff before Warcraft, but it's because you know, Invoker, he is a, a character from Warcraft. And so it's nice that they kind of kept the, the, the same resemblance in it. I enjoy it. I, I think that's a nice little uh, feature of the designs. The disease has infected her blood. I have read every book, consulted with every scholar, healer, all of you. Nothing. We have done everything. Oh, man. So Invoker is just, he's just losing it right now because he can't do anything to save his daughter. Ooh. And then he just teleports them. Oh my god, it's like getting into her, her face and all. What if this is, what if this is the wife's doing? You know, what if this is, this is, uh, Selimene is doing? Like, what if, like, she's the one that is poisoning her? Oh, she took the. She went this way, straight into Air Dragon territory. Mm-hmm. Dragon, your turn. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. They found her. You know her blinking ability is very similar to uh, Akasha's. Her blinking ability is very similar to the Queen of Pain's blinking, where she—it's like she disintegrates can't touch it oh it's got yeah because invoker's got magic spell on it oh she can't blink with it like she has to run because if she blinks it immediately just drops oh buddy it's a nest she ran right into a trap whoa 
dang, she got him in the eye. What a shot. Dodge, dodge. Oh, sagging. Here it comes. Here we go. A big battle. Yeah, they know. They know their place. They know. Oh! Dude, Mirana just like took down those dragons on her own. They know their place. That's right. No. He won't I, do it. He's not going to do it. I am yours, Selimene. He's doing it. You have my devotion, my faith. No, but then remember if, 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 if he, if it's not true, and you, she could feel it. Child, speak the words. Yeah. Whoa. Speak the words. I won't save him. You have me. Just heal her. Selimene, come back. Yeah. So she, she turned herself into a god. Whoa. Oh my goodness, that's how he gets his powers. Just like her. Come back. Kaden! Yes, I knew he wasn't dead. Yes. He's still hunting him. Man, that guy's a badass. Davion was here. Oh hey, that's his guy. We hunt north. That's his guy. His guy's looking for him. So we are on the last episode. Episode eight. Episode seven felt like it was super fast. Watch. Oh, here we go. Is that the Blood Moon? Yeah. She was. Remember, Luna was talking about it. Oh, it broke the spell. Selimani's powers got got nullified. The view of the goddess. It's worse than that. They know. Please, everyone. The Dark Moon Order will leave here in peace, as we agreed. But I'm not. I never will be. There we go. I'm not here to fight you. Oh, don't, don't. Oh my God. And Luna's going in. Oh, he spent all these years developing the power to negate Selimene's powers. Our lady, she is. Oh snap! Wow. Oh, what's he doing? What the heck? What in the world? Oh, oh my goodness! Fleet. Oh no! <laughs> Fleeting. I will enjoy. He's here! Oh! <laughs> ah! Terra Blade. Oh my God! He has control over her people. Rejoice, demon. I reach you with a gift. Oh shit! Oh my goodness, what is, oh all sorts of shit is happening right now. These people they have no idea what's going on. Here. They're just fighting a pointless war right now. The real war is between Invoker, Terrorblade, and Salamani. Come on, Luna, let's see what you got. No mana. Ooh, ooh. 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 Oh, she she wants to kill Luna. Ooh, somebody getting wrecked. Luna's getting wrecked. Oh, mash! Checkmate. What you got, Dragonite? Fuck. Oh yes. Let's go. Y'all don't want none of this. Ooh, children, your, your violence is like kindness in the shadow of. Oh <laughs> yes. <laughs> Let's go. Show them how weak they are. <laughs> Selimene, the usurper. Let's go, Terra. Transform, man. Let's see that transformation. Your child, Philomena. She died hating you. You know this. Do not speak her name. It's so been, cool. <laughs> how many broken things have you 
Let's go. Oh, oh, oh. He's transforming. Let's go. Let's go. He sent you to torment me. I struck a bargain. Yeah! Let's go, Terrorblade. End this shit. Seven souls for one. Yours. God dang. Oh, refraction or whatever, reflection or reflect or whatever that move is. Oh, oh. She got powers too, though. Made herself a god so she might never be alone. Sunder. Let's go. Her faithful silent. Ooh, damn. <laughs> Yo, Terrible got no chill. Oh, she dead. Do you know what a demon calls a god who does not know worship? He's still in her soul. Food. Woo! Shit. Damn. Slyra is just going through everybody. Whoosh! <laughs> I'm just like, do you people not see this guy flying around? He is like destroying everybody. If I'm you guys, I'd be like, fuck, fuck, fuck this. I ain't, this, this ain't my fight anymore. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, here comes the Dragon Knights. Let's go. Another one. Caden's back. The mouse who thunders. Come to rejoin our battle. Release my bonds. I will die. Done fighting you. I'm here for the boy. We're gonna help you. Get him up. Get him home. <laughs> That's it. I could do this for eternity. Perhaps in the next universe. Yo, Terrorblade is so strong. And Invokers come back. Do you love me? Ooh! He just fucking reverse psychology her ass. Because we all know what that's going to be. All right. So the last two episodes was insane. We got to see one dragon get captured by Invoker. But I think he had already captured all of them. Because later he says. Because later Terribly says seven souls for one soul. So he, I think he had terribly, I think terribly had a uh, uh, invoker capture all seven of the dragons. Then in return, he would come and he would defeat Salamene for invoker. And then invoker reversed the script on her. And he was like, do you love me to her? Because obviously now he's the one with the power and she doesn't have any power left because, you know, no one believes in her and terribly, I guess he absorbed all her powers. So this has got to be the reason why there's a season two, because the fact that how season one ended, it, it looks like the dragons may have contacted Caden because we got to see Caden. Caden, they came back, they captured Davion and Slyrak thought that Caden wanted to finish the fight. But Caden was like, no, we're here for the boy. So maybe what we're going to get to see is Caden is now is maybe the dragons contacted Caden and the Dragonites and told them the purpose of the Dragonites. So now we're getting to see three factions. We get to see the Night Silver and the the, the Blood and and the, uh, the 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 Elves, right? With with Luna, uh, Mirana, and the, and the Elves. We get obviously the Codewig Elves, and then we're we're getting to also see Invoker's side, right? Him and 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 then Terrorblade. And I guess now the new faction that we're gonna get to see play a really big part in all this now are the Dragonites. I mean, because it did start off that this is called Dragon's Blood, obviously, but then the fact that they ended off with each side kind of setting up their their parts of the story to to you know essentially battle an even bigger war like we like what happened to the dragons and the thunder and the mountain of and you know the thunder mountains what happened to the dragons what's going to happen to selamene what's going to happen to terribly what's going to happen to davion marana all of them so much is going to happen but I really like the way like the like seven episode seven and eight was like like seven we got to see that the the, the lesser dragons they respect the the, the elder the eldworms right they respect the guys like sly rack and them but terrorblade is so powerful that he is an entity that they fend off that's crazy it takes like all of them to fend him off which is nuts like that's crazy but 
that was it if you guys like this reaction hit the like subscribe ring that bell for notification guys this is it for for uh dota dragon's blood season one also see the link down below support us on our patreon become a supporter of agashi and i actually our patreon we would deeply deeply thank you guys oh i am going to be continuing my bleach reactions yes it's been a while but i i i you know wanted to get the the dota one out of the way first because i was like super duper hyped for it so i'm gonna get back into the bleach reactions that's all i got guys we see you guys in the next anime reaction which is gonna be back to bleach and i found some other anime that i want to react to but if there if there are any any other anime reactions you guys would like me to see just let me know drop a comment hit the like subscribe ring that bell for notification guys this is ajashi we out